Controlling your dreams is epic, okay? It allows you to experience and enjoy anything you can imagine in your mind. But there's a problem. Sometimes reality checks, which is one of the ways that you can learn how to lucid dream, don't show up in your dreams. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you a three-step process which guarantees that your reality checks, so the tests you do to test whether you're dreaming or not, will make sure that you they show up in your dreams and that you become lucid. It's a very proven, easy way to lucid dream. And if you get this right, it's actually pretty reliable as well. By the way, throughout this video, there are some small awareness tests that I've thrown in. So see if you can spot them. Don't scroll down to the comments because if you scroll down to the comments, you're gonna see people who have already found them and it's gonna ruin the whole experience for you. So don't scroll down to the comments yet. Just pay attention to this video. It's only a few minutes long and see if you can notice, maybe write them down or something on your phone or in a notepad. See if you can notice the awareness. Okay, so reality checks. Here's where I think people get them wrong. This is step one. It is not just about a physical action. What most people think with reality tests is that what you do is you just try and breathe through your nose while it's pinched or you try and look at your watch and check if the time changes when you look back at it or something. It's, it's not about that. That's, that's just one aspect of it which really doesn't matter as much, anywhere near as much as the mental aspect. So don't forget about the physical action just for a second. You need to, and this is really step one, okay? You need to pretend when you're doing your reality tests that you don't know whether you're dreaming or not. You don't know whether you're awake or not. You need to genuinely, and maybe this is where some acting will come in, or if you've ever done like role playing or acting drama classes, really, really get into character for a second. Pretend that you have no idea whether this is a dream or not. Pretend it's like a hyper realistic simulation. And your, your job is to try and figure out, is this a simulation or am I actually here right now? This is, and it gets quite exciting when you really try and pretend that this right now, this experience could be a dream. And this is really what you need to do every single time. Otherwise, there's no point, they won't work. So then step two, this is three steps. The third one's the most important. Step two is that you need to then on top of that belief and that kind of pretending that you don't know, then you build in the physical thing. So then you tell yourself and you really need to believe it, otherwise it won't work. You tell yourself when I push my finger through my palm, if it goes through like that, I'm dreaming. If it doesn't go through, I'm awake. And that's the only way that you will know whether you're dreaming or not. It's very important. By the way, I have a blueprint ebook that I put together which tells you exactly, it breaks down step by step how to master reality checks and how to literally guarantee that they show up in your dreams most times, like nine out of 10 times and make you lucid. So, and because there's an art to this, it's like a recipe you need to follow. If you're interested in that, go and check out the link in the description to the ultimate reality text guide or just go to howtolucid.com and it should be somewhere there on the site. So number three, the most important is that once you've you know, master the first two steps, you need to really stack it as a habit. So you need to do it consistently and not just go through the motions consistently, you need to do it in exactly the way I described every time. So every time you do a reality test, you need to first pretend that you don't know it's a dream and really question, look around you and question, is this experience, is it possible that this experience right now is a simulation or a dream? Really try and ask yourself that and then do the physical test. So push your finger through the palm or pinch the nose, whatever, and then make sure you do those first two consistently as a habit. Apparently 80% or more people who watch this video are not subscribed. So if you're watching this now and you're not subscribed, it would really, I would really appreciate it if you can just scroll down, click subscribe, click like on the video, and then comment down below, what is what are you struggling the most with, with reality test? Because you're probably doing something wrong. And I can, if you tell me what you're doing, I can comment and tell you what you're doing wrong and how you can improve it. 